quicker than normal, so just have to get the ball out to those guys in space. You know, there's not many Oregon quarterbacks who've gone back to back 10 win seasons. I mean, what does that mean to you? Because it's it's not that easy. Really oh yeah, it's not easy at all. Just take hard work, hard work and discipline, staying focused on the on the task at hand, staying about football only. So it's kind of a hard deal. Just hard for the quarterbacks coming up. <laughs> Short week of preparation. How do you feel like you guys will respond having to come back tomorrow? You know, an opponent you haven't scouted yet, didn't think you'd be playing this year. Oh, I think I think we're gonna do a good job is getting ready for those guys. I think we it's not really a short of preparation. We still getting the same amount of days. Games on a Friday. We have played games on Thursday, so same amount of preparation. Just gotta get back in tomorrow. Start moving, get ready for UCLA. Ready to play those guys. Talk a bit about uh, David Paulson's uh, performance today. Oh, I think DP, he's been one of the most consistent guys all year. Just coming out each week, he's banged up sometimes. You wouldn't even know. He's a guy that's consistent. Got the ball to him, caught every ball I threw to him. So good game for DP. From and an X, uh, from an X and O perspective, what were they doing to, to leave him open? Well, it's actually just it's a part of their defense, a part of any team, any team defense that plays that type of coverage is leaving that, that boundary flat always open. So hoping that the team just rally down to it. But we took advantage of it today. And just as far as uh, the last week was concerned, I mean, you guys usually say uh, that, you know, you treat every week the same. But the fact that you came off kind of a tough loss, did that motivate you guys a little more this week? Oh, yeah, it motivated us a lot to just come out, show the guys what we can do. Really wanted to show ourselves again what we can do. So we came out this game kind of with emphasis to come out and get some respect from the Pac-12. It was a civil war. I, you know, it's, I know for you guys, you talk about every game being the same, but you know those fans that that means a lot. Oh, yeah, it's a big time thing. I'm glad that we got it for Eugene. I told the guys earlier this week that we want to win it for Eugene. It's more than just a regular game. It's a big game for me. It's a big game for the team. Ever since I got here, a lot of people have told me about the Civil War game, and it means a lot to the to the fans. So I'm happy that we came out to get the victory. Any other questions for Darren? Darren, I guess Lamike gave you a little bit of a scare there in the third quarter, but it seems like he's OK and you guys are ready to roll on Friday. Oh, yeah, I think Lamike's doing all right. He's He's one of those guys that's battle tested. He's want to come out each game and run his hardest. You know, he's a guy that don't want to go down. So kind of can learn from the situation a little bit for his part. But I think Lamar, he's a tough guy. He's be, he'll be with me on Friday. What took you guys a little while to get rolling there through the first quarter and a half or so? I just got to get, get see the adjustment that those guys are going to make. We really don't know what type of defense they're going to come out and play us in because they play us differently each year. So really had to just make the adjustments and just come out and execute in the second quarter. Darren. You winged it better today, Darren. Do you feel like you passed the ball better today than you have in recent games? Oh, yeah. We got the ball out to, to some guys in space, let those guys. That's what is going to win us the game today because Coach Kelly wanted us to come out, get the ball out in space to open up the run game. So it was on the receivers, the tight ends, and the quarterbacks to get the ball out to, the, to everybody and make sure we can spread the lanes open for the run game. Darren, you talked about what it means to Eugene. What does it mean to the team to win the Civil <clears throat> War? When the North Division advanced to the, the conference championship? Well, it means a lot. We just really accomplished one of the goals that we put up on our goal list to come out, make sure we, we clinched the Pac-12 North. So next week we got a big game. But it's one of our goals checked off the list. Still got more to check off. You feel like you you performed better, though. Did you feel healthier out there, a little more mobile, a little just throwing the ball crisper? Oh, yeah, I'm getting healthier each game. Treatment center's doing a good job getting me healthy, ready to go. Coaches put me in the best looks to get my get the balls out of my hands. Some of my balls still high that I want to clean up, so still got a lot of things to work on. But it's a great performance all around by the offensive and the defensive team. Darren, you said that there were more more goals to check off. What what are the goals you guys have? Uh, first, we just want to get first, we just want to get to the end of the season. It's our last game of our season, so our first goal is to come out, pick up our head at the end of the season, see where we was going to play at, or if we can play the next game. And we checked off that goal because we still got one more game to play. Asked you guys to be off to the Rose Bowl after this game. What are your thoughts on the new setup? Uh, I, I love this setup because it makes if you maybe lose a couple of games, you maybe you're not out of it. So you really still got a shot for those other teams to come in. If you're on the top dog, you really don't want to be give the other guys another shot to beat you. But if you got if you maybe lose a couple of games, mess up here and there, I think you should get the opportunity to come back and play us. We should show and we got to show the Pac-12 again that we can come out, continue to do the things, and we the best best team in the Pac-12. How nice is it? Oh, it's a big thing that we get to host it back in Eugene's for the fans. Exciting to play in the first Pac-12 game.